Hi Christy in Ready Kitchen and today I'm making a edible fruit arrangement and so what you need is a whole pineapple, about 20 fresh strawberries, two whole bananas, eight of these ho-hos or Swiss rolls they call them, a couple tablespoons of lemon juice and about 20 of these wooden skewers. So first we're going to prepare a pineapple boat for the base. So what you're going to do is cut a third of that pineapple off. We're going to have the leaves remain intact. So with a sharp knife, just going to cut down. And then we're going to save this part. And then we're going to use this. So what I'm going to do is cut it in half. Make sure the core is out. And I'm just going to go through and wedge it like this. And then we're going to like fillet that off. So I'll just go through each side. Now if you wanted to serve this as boats, you'd put that on a plate and you could serve it with a meal like that. But we're actually going to save these and you can discard the peeling. And then we're going to cut these ho-hos into three even slices. So you're going to make two cuts and that's on eight of them. And then on 20 strawberries we're going to just slice just below that where the leafy part ends. Just straight off. And the bananas we'll just slice into one inch pieces. And now these you'll want to dip in some lemon juice and drain them on paper towels because it'll prevent them from turning brown. So now we're ready to place these on the skewers. So on one skewer we're just going to use two pieces. It can be any combination. I'm going to do a banana. And then these you want to put so the swirly part points out. Kind of makes a cute little effect. And then on six skewers, we're going to put three pieces. So maybe I'll do pineapple, strawberry, and you want to make sure you slide them down the pointed end. And then on three skewers, we're going to place four pieces of fruit and cake. And then on three skewers we're going to put five pieces of fruit and cake. You might have to slide it down a little further. And then on the last three we're going to add six pieces of fruit and cake. And you want to slide them um, 
towards the pointed end, but you want to leave about two inches. So now I have all my skewers assembled and now we're ready to put it in the pineapple. If your pineapple doesn't sit straight on your plate, um, you can just level it off, just remove some of that peeling there. All right, now we're ready to start assembling. So your one skewer that had two pieces, the pointed side down, we're going to put it in this corner. And then with a pruning shears or this kitchen scissors, we're going to cut that stick off and it's going to go flying, but that's okay. <laughs> okay, now we're going to work diagonal. So my next one, now, so we have three skewers with, or excuse me, six skewers with three pieces on it. So stick it in there, push the fruit to the bottom, cut it, I'm cutting it about an inch from the top. And then we're going to put this one right behind that two piece one. And some are going to be a little taller than others, depending on how big your strawberries were. Now this would be cute as a table centerpiece for an event. Maybe you're raising money for a fundraiser. Um, also all the knives I use in these videos, you can sell them um, to make a 40% profit for your fundraiser. If you're interested in that, check out our website. Okay, so now I have my six skewers with three pieces on. Now I'm going to go to the four piece skewers. And it's just going to add height. It's going to build it up this way. I think it's really cute with these little swirly ho-hos on there. And you could have a fruit dip in a bowl that people could spoon onto their plates or they could just dip them in this way. And we're ending up with our skewers that have six of them. And as you get to the these that are loaded with six items, you might not even have to cut them because you do want to have enough of the skewers so people can hold on to them. And here's our Sweet Swirl Fruit Edible Arrangement. It's Looks too pretty to eat, but it's too delicious to not eat. It'd be really good served with one of the rated quick mix sweet dips. And hope you have fun making it.